Okay, today I've decided that I would share my five favorite RTX resource packs that I think would be great to use when you are looking for an RTX pack for the 1.17 update, so stay with me. Alright, so starting at number one, I present Kelly's RTX. It is a very well known vanilla RTX pack, and for good reason. It is one of the best versions of vanilla RTX and most of the pack being very streamlined and universally accepting for anyone getting used to RTX visuals in Minecraft, of course. And among the five, I'd recommend this resource pack to anyone wanting to get a feel of very high quality graphics that RTX is capable of. Number two on our list today is another amazing vanilla RTX pack, the truly vanilla RTX normals. Yes, it's another vanilla RTX pack, but this pack is very special in that it's actually your regular old vanilla, but with a very nice stylistic twist. You can tell that the creator of this pack put a lot of time in putting different accents on each of the blocks in the game to give you more unique feels and textures to suit each block's character. I really love how it's really vanilla, but with a bolder flavor, and I love that artistic flair that this pack gives to the user. Great overall, and I highly recommend to someone who wants to delve deeper in what RTX visuals are in store for this lovely game. And our last vanilla RTX pack on the list is Defined PBR, which lands number three on today's spot. This vanilla resource pack goes on and improves what Kelly's RTX has in store, but with more added visuals and different interpretations on what is an already fantastic rendition of vanilla RTX. If you want to get a different feel, but want to stay on the tamer side of things, Define PBR is a great choice to use as your main RTX pack for your optimal vanilla experience. Alright, now I would like to move on to the last two RTX packs that aren't vanilla, but ones that take advantage of the enhanced offerings of ray tracing, and apply it on a different level. And with that, we have number 4, the Kingdom of Wallace. I chose this pack because it takes full advantage of super high resolution texture maps, and adds ray tracing to it. What an amazing combination, isn't it? A technique to combine both visuals together is no easy task. And this pack explores what high definition detailing and ray tracing can do to create some awe-inspiring gaming graphics. Well done to the creator, and it is definitely not easy to pull something like this off. And finally, we have our last pack on the list, which is Real Source RTX. This is another high resolution resource pack that once again takes advantage of RTX visuals and applies them to high resolution textures. This pack contains some great refined detailing that has been worked on over time. I think that highly detailed packs like these and the Kingdom of Wallace have promising future in the realm of Minecraft RTX, and that's why I decided to put ultra realistic high end detailed graphics like these in the video today. And that's it. These are my five picks for the best RTX packs for 1.17. I know that 1.17 is coming pretty close with the build test one released just a few days ago indicating that 1.17 is actually around the corner. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to give a thumbs up if you liked it, subs if you loved it, and I will see you in another video very soon. Take care.